no sound in your Windows 11 and suddenly your favorite videos feel way too quiet? Don't panic because in today's video, I'll show you how to fix sound issues step by step from checking your speakers to updating your drivers. By the end of this video, your PC will be singing, alerting and binging like normal again. Let's bring the sound back. Hey, what's up everyone? I'm Steph and in this channel, I teach you quick daily tech tips that make your life a little easier. Click on the Windows Start button on the bottom. Click on Settings. On the left column, click on System. Then, click on Sound. Under the Output section, make sure the correct speakers are chosen. If the wrong option is chosen, the sound will not be played correctly from the correct output. Next, under Volume, Slide the bar to see if there's any increase or decrease in the sound output when you do so. Then, go back to your desktop and click on the search button at the bottom. Search for Device Manager. Look for the option Audio Inputs and Outputs. Look for the device on your computer that is supposed to be playing sound, which are the speakers. Right click on the device and select Update Driver. The reason is so because maybe there's a new update driver for your speakers and somehow it is not compatible with the current setup. Click on search automatically for drivers where Windows will search for the best available driver and install it for you. If it still does not work, it could also be that your recently updated Windows and the new driver is not compatible, so you have to revert to the previous version of your speaker drivers. To do this, right click on your device and select properties. Click on driver. If this scenario is happening, you will be able to see the option of rollback driver and you can revert back to the previous driver version of your speakers. If this is still not working, another option is to get diagnostics help. On the bottom of your desktop, click on the search icon and type in get help. Type in no sound. then. Select the option under the section, do we have your consent to run automated diagnostics to try solving your audio problems? Click on yes and the automation will begin and hopefully they will manage to find the problem. If everything else still fails, it could be that it is a hardware issue. Maybe the sound card inside your computer has burned out or become faulty after prolonged usage and you can bring it to a local computer to get it checked replace or fixed. There you go. If you found today's video useful, do give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more useful videos like this. Until the next video, I'm Steph. Take care and bye-bye.